what I think I want to do is get to the root cause so you can get a better outcome. So the idea is to cure cancer. Is there such a thing, you, you may ask? Well, I do believe so. The cynicism is, no, you can't. We are always going to die. There are always things that are killing us. Everything else is marketing. How do you receive the criticism? Because if you just look at what I call universal truths, okay. One of the universal truths is this oldest person on the planet just passed away. The University of Barcelona did the entire analysis of a blood, a tissue, and everything else. The only thing that they could find that was really positive was the protection of the immune system. She had an active immune system. That's the key right there. Remember the immune system's army of cells? Dr. Sun Shang says one soldier in particular, something called the natural killer cell, has the potential to change everything. You have in your body, God-given, a cell that kills cancer, that kills TB, that kills HIV, that kills COVID, a cell called the natural killer cell that is your body's first responder. We just haven't figured that out. A healthy adult has around 2 billion natural killer cells in their blood. You can measure them with a blood test called the ALC, the absolute lymphocyte count. The doctor offered to test mine. Let's see, let's see. Wow. I would think you had better veins than that. It's already a bad sign. <laughs> He's long believed that this cell, properly functioning and activated, can kill cancer. The problem is, most common treatments in use today, chemotherapy, radiation, they might destroy cancer cells, but they come with a terrible cost. They also wipe out much of the immune system's army. What goes away? The actual cells that are probably helping to fight the fight that we need. Everything we've been doing, advertently or inadvertently, is killing the natural killer cell as we try to treat you. Think about that logic. Everything from radiation to chemotherapy has been inducing the destruction of the natural killer cell. So if you go to what you call first principles, the only thing that you need to protect in your body is your natural killer cell. And if you protect that, that's what actually not only prevents cancer, but treats cancer and maybe cures cancer. Building on these ideas, Soon Shang came up with Anctiva, an immunotherapy drug he claims has the potential to target all forms of cancer. Anctiva, what does the drug do in the For Dummies version? The natural killer cell all have on their surface a receptor that's looking for a protein that your body makes called IL-15, interleukin-15. Most important molecule is IL-15. Anctiva is that IL-15. It is the switch that actually binds to the NK cell and activates and proliferates them and make them supercharged. In other words, when the natural killer cell is treated with IL-15, amazing things happen. The cell becomes stronger, more durable, and it multiplies faster, turning a normal soldier into the equivalent of the Incredible Hulk, powerful enough to take on those cancer cells and kill them. Take a look at this time-lapse video of a supercharged NK cell in action. So the green is a regular breast cell. Correct. The red is a breast cancer cell. Correct. And, and the gray is a natural killer cell. So the natural killer cell has the capacity to identify cancer cells, infected cells, abnormal cells, and selectively kill it. This gray natural killer cell is hunting it down on the left, identifying it as an abnormal cell and killing it from the outside in. Look at it explode. Watch again closely. This is the potential game changer. The first responder NK cell killing cancer right before your eyes. If you give yourself Anctiva, even in healthy volunteers, it dries up your first responders. It dries up your protectors. And that's why I said the power is within us. We truly have a chance to change the paradigm. But it's a long road from the whiteboard to the lab to the cancer clinic where real patients get real results. To get there, you need to go through here the FDA. And that's where this medical genius ran into a problem he couldn't solve. You're a fix-it guy. I'm a fix-it guy. How come you haven't been able to fix your problems with the regulatory community? With patients' lives hanging in the balance, time and hope may be running out. I was truly devastated. I'm not sure if this change will happen. Stay with us. 
Thank you for watching. Subscribe below and download our News Nation app right now on your phone, and you will get fact based, unbiased news for all Americans.